a little bit about the show. Um, it is uh, set, set in New York City, and it is about a young woman named Carly who is in corporate America. She actually works for a marketing company, and um, she's very, very good at what she does, and she's underpaid, and she's very much underappreciated at work. And there's lots of different characters that circle around her at her job. And um, two of them are um, her male coworkers, and one of them is annoying coworker Andy. <laughs> and like the, first, the second scene of the show, um, she's at her office and she's like doing her work, and he like comes in and is like, hey Carly, how's it going? I like your sweater. <laughs> and like she wears sweaters that are just too small for her. And um, and so he's the super annoying character, and then she's got this sleazy boss, Dan, who's like this Tim Curry type, who's like, hey, doll, and he's like always interrupting her when she talks. She's like, oh yeah, that's nice, but would you be a doll and go and get me a latte from downstairs? Thanks, darling, thank you. Like, he's super, super gross, too. So um, after this scene, they've been in the office, Carly leaves to go get them their coffee, and Dan and Andy are by the water cooler talking about her. And this is the flagship song of Boobs called Boobs. <sighs> Look at her. She's such a dork. I don't know who she makes it work. She does her job. And she comes on time. Ha, he said come. <laughs> if only it were kosher for HR to allow full exposure to the gifts her blouse conceals inside. <laughs> <laughs> She's got boobs. <laughs> Glorious boobs. The best things in life seem to come in twos. From here up, she ain't so fine. But from here down, at Title Nine, oh yes, she's got boobs. She's got jugs. <laughs> Fabulous jugs. I love it when she has to give me hugs. When her pillows hit my chest, my manly bits think it's the best. Oh, yes, she's got jugs. She's got this whiny voice that asks me questions every day. And wears these little sweaters with her goodies on display. That might be a sign she needs a tour and love affair. So take a picture. From Donald Trump and grab her by the you know where. <laughs> She's got tits. <laughs> Wonderful tits. <laughs> the best description is that they're the tits. When she comes upstairs with morning coffee, I start playing pocket hockey. Oh, yes, <laughs> she's got tits. <laughs> she's got breasts. <laughs> Beautiful breasts. For Christmas this year, I've but one request. That she sit upon my lap so you can see inside her booby trap. Oh my, <laughs> she's got breasts. It's a special kind of beauty how they jiggle as she walks. They bounce when she comes up the stairs to work at nine o'clock. She's the kind of gal I'd like to ask out on a date. Then never text or call again cause we've already had our way. Never text or call again, cause we've already had our way. Cue the dancing girls with the feathers. She's got boobs. Magical boobs. Between tits and ass, you know which one we chose. We can help. 
society just understand her gazongas make me bonkers oh white creamer ringer beamers i believe it in her cleavage or the top is gonna pop i'd be a felon with those melons take a sip of a nipple massive poppers who turn knockers oh it's her and her hooters oh yeah